And with that, I'd like to introduce uh, Lindsey Brungeon, a senior in, at the Univers University of Illinois, majoring in uh, agribusiness. Well, hello. Um, I'm Lindsey Brunchen, uh, as Casey said, and I attended um, tracks one through three, uh, freshman through junior year, and uh, still desired to be a part of the AFA um, going into senior year. Um, and so went into the fall, um, senior year, and planned to attend the Alliance um, and found that um, companies don't have a formal application process for sponsorship um, to the Alliance as they do with tracks one through three. Um, and so that led me, uh, since I happened not to have an internship um, the previous summer, I um, first we went to um, the dean of the Ag College at the University of Illinois um, and that really found that he was um, more than happy and, and glad to, to fund me to attend the Alliance um, and was searching for um, some money that um, alumni had donated for a cause um, really similar to AFA. Um, and I would even suggest that searching uh, for uh, money as a senior to attend the Alliance um, can be very similar to that of searching for scholarships for um, something like study abroad, for instance. Um, and so there's a lot of options um, um, through the university as well. I would definitely also suggest just uh, asking companies um, if they would even be interested in, in sponsoring you, especially if you um, had had an internship the previous summer. Um, and also, especially if, if you've already interviewed with them for, for a full-time job um, the coming year, um, if, if you are um, planning on working with a the company, they would probably surely be interested in, in helping you attend the Alliance. Um, if the dean at your college or um, university um, person hasn't isn't familiar with the AFA, I would go back to a lot of the, the things that Paul and Casey talked about, um, just kind of outlining for them how um, attending um, AFA would, would um, just enhance your education experience um, and make you a, a more valuable empo employee um, to someone in the future. Um, AFA, um, is also in the process of considering the development of a track four. Um, and so these situations may change over the years. And I know they're trying to decide how to, to best reach out to seniors. And so um, in the future, the, that could also be an option instead of attending the Alliance senior year. Some of the just real quick benefits that I um, got out of going to the Alliance as, as a senior um, was just getting to visit informally with recruiters um, and getting to spend really a whole day and a half with pe with people um, whose job it is to interview you. It's, uh, it was just really great to be able to sit um, next to recruiters and, and talk with them on the same side of the table um, and get in a more informal atmosphere as compared to a career fair. Um, it was also just really um, beneficial for me to just get firsthand info on um, some of the challenges that new hires face and um, just their experiences throughout the year. Um, topics that I'm not as that I wasn't as familiar with going into the alliance, such as salary negotiation or various benefits they that um, you need to understand as going into the workforce. Um, and just what typical a typical work week would look like in various companies. Um, it really gave me an overview of, of not only the internship programs, um, but also full time um, full time job openings that different agribusiness companies offer um, throughout the industry. Um, so yeah, I would say that um, I would even venture to say that out of all four years that. I attended AFA, the Alliance um, was the most exciting and um, definitely just as beneficial, if not more, than the previous three years. Some of the misconceptions that um, I think a lot of my 
um, fellow classmates had um, that didn't attend the alliance was they thought maybe that they wouldn't fit in or that possibly the alliance wasn't going to be as valuable because um, they weren't on the same age group level as everyone else. Um, but that just really wasn't the case for me last year. Um, and so, yeah, I would um, really encourage you just to, to seek um, some sponsorship. Um, and with that, I'll go ahead and hand it over to Adam Anderson. He's on the Alliance Planning Committee, and he is currently the membership chair and works with Pioneer Hybrid International.